Prologue. You are listening at FameTV.info. Solo Leveling. Ragnarok Episode 0 Lost Worlds Without Gods are just delicious prey, outer gods absolute beings that have created countless universes since ancient times, Yiths, the scattered Yiths in different dimensions realized that their masters had disappeared in a faraway dimension and their eyes gleamed, they did not care about the deaths of their own kind what mattered to them was the enormous mana that remained in that world. The one who picks up the power of a lost master becomes the new master, thus, the Prologue of the Outer God War began, Kra dot a rift between dimensions that connects different universes. The Yiths tore down the sturdy dimensional walls with their power and poured out in droves. A man stood in front of them, Song Jin. Wu, the greatest shard of radiance and shadow lord, opened his mouth with black energy swirling around his entire body, rise up. With those words, Tens of millions of armies made up of angels of light and shadow legions simultaneously brandished their weapons, and so, the war began. And no matter how many invaders of the memorization come, they endlessly stormed in, never. Ending. A tense battle that could not let go of the heart even for a moment had been going on for a long time, I can't see the end at all. In fact, it's a miracle that we've lasted this long. From the beginning, this war was a disadvantageous fight for us. I agree. If it weren't for the Shadow Lord, our defense line would have been breached immediately. The rulers and the six dot winged angels showed respect to Song Jin. Wu, they were shining fragments born as apostles of God, they were beings who realized the cruelty of God at some point and became God. Killers by their own will, perhaps this war was predetermined from that moment. The apostles of Iterim are still being born at this moment. Meanwhile, our troops are stagnant. The soldiers of the sky led by the rulers have been born from the fruit of the world tree since ancient times, however, since God died, the world tree has gradually stopped bearing fruit that it was said that reinforcements were impossible. If it weren't for the shadow legion that kept resurrecting even if Song Jin. Wu died, this war would have been over in an instant. As an absolute end of the destruction of this world. My lord, we're in big trouble. Egret, the commander of the legion, appeared urgently in front of Song Jin. Wu, the rear defense line has been breached. Where is it? That, they aimed for the area with the weakest magic power. Is it Earth? I can't believe it. I'm sorry. Due to the concentration of troops in the front, the rear guard was insufficient. Song Jin. Wu sighed low, Earth, which had barely regained peace, was once again exposed to danger the gate will open again on earth. The rulers murmured as they watched Song Jin. Wu. once, earth was invaded by the residents of the underworld, the rulers, who were the culprits of that incident, hurriedly made excuses, but the situation is different from our time. That's right. Our purpose was to grow earth and protect it from the rulers. But Iterim's purpose is pure invasion. They are trying to undermine us by collapsing the weakest point in the rear. My lord. We need to send troops to Earth quickly. The rulers strongly opposed Egret's claim, we forbid it. If we split our troops, we've barely held on so far. The balance of the power that was being held will be broken. That was the plan of Iterim from the beginning. If we focus on defending our rear, and the front line breaks through, we will ultimately lose. Having listened to their heated argument, Song Jin. Wu finally made a decision, Vera. Kikik. Your Majesty. The Ant King, who was busy tearing apart the enemy's limbs, responded to his call, General Vera. You are summoned here. Go to Earth. Kaihak. Are you serious? Song Jin. Wu nodded heavily, yes. It seems like it's time to release the Seal of Protection. Vera's eyes widened with anticipation, go as fast as possible. Your order is received. At that command, Vera turned into a beam of light and flew to Earth, Song Jin. Wu's gaze, which had been silently watching Vera's back, returned to the enemies that were coming at him, his lips were tightly sealed, and his eyes burned fiercely, come, foreign apostles. Listen to the full novel at fametv.info, direct link in the description.